What are you doing here? What's going on here? Hiya, how are we doing? It's been a while. That kind of gentleman, uh, Johan, shaven butcher, was kind enough to tag me into Five Soap Challenge. Five soaps you couldn't live without or can't live without, or whatever the hell it is. So, as I haven't been around much recently, just finish shaving my head. Any interest? Layer cream, Yaki horse brush, rainbow, where it is, Rockwell, success, on plate four with a blade in it. However, that's not the purpose. I hope you're all well. Staying COVID free, I've had my first job, knock the shit out of me. 24, 24 hours later, started to go like that. Just felt horrible. That night, in bed, cold, sweats, sweats, cold, just sh aches, pains, shivers. It was like a good dose of man flu times three. Didn't really feel good. Next day, we're fine, sorted. Must have drank like three litres of water that night. And no, I wasn't urinating like an elephant during the course of the night. The computer went bang, so I had to get a few parts to fix that. And as I edit all my videos on computer, just been shaving away. Merely to myself without talking crap to a video camera. Not much fun in that. I hope you're all well. So, I'll get this head shave finished off. And then we'll take some soaps out and have a, bl have a blather. See you in a minute. Okay, we're back. Heads, heads all nicely shaved. That's the com my computer is restarting. Hopefully, it doesn't hit, take too much noise. Even though I need to replace one of the fans because it's a bit, uh, a bit lumpy. So, where's my list at? This challenge, this tag videos, is five sections. The first being sent. For that one, Ariana and Evans, Khalifa. This is based around, I think it's Afghano Black Nostromo, the uh, Eau de Perfume or Eau de Toilette. Fantastic scent. Nice, deep, woody, heavy. Yeah. Fantastic. That's scent done. That one's nice and simple. The next one is selection. You could say um partial to this soap maker. Three, six, twelve. Sixteen. Sixteen soaps. Wickham, 1912. Vegan soap made by Darren Barnes in Sussex, I believe, in the UK. Uh, let me note that. Excuse the noise. There's some six, twelve lots of soap going over. Probably one of my favourite of the lot is Club Cola, as you can see there. It's a soap. I think of Cola Cubes as a kid. It's one I could use daily and I doubt I would get bored with it. Of 
quick read, excuse me. The next one is sentiment. I'm basing this on a soap base because this soap maker now produces small batches of one cent, sells it out, his next batch is a different cent. That is OSP, the obsessive soap perfectionist. James Riley in uh, down London where I, wherever he is, yeah, sentiment. I was forced to meet, meet up with, with James before Christmas uh, for a get together. We, we agreed to do a video, like a Q&A sort of video, but then Covid kicked in and that all got knocked out. James's soaps are towel based and it's top quality soap base, it really is. As I say, he now varies his scents month by month or release by release, they are always monthly depending on what he's doing. So that's sentiment. And James is a bloody nice chap. Value. Some people are going to go, you're joking. Value. I'll give you, give you a second to guess what it is. What my soap of value is. Anybody guess Martin de Candra? At this point you're all going, you're off your head. A soap of value. Yeah, a soap of value. 200 grams. Harder than a hockey puck. Yes, it's not cheap. However, three tubs of A&E cost more and that'll last longer. That is the purpose for that value. I just happened to pick out vetiver, which is a lovely scent, akin to Wickham. I've got, I think I've got all the Martin de Candras now, and they're all fantastic scents. So that is my soap of choice for value. That's a bit of a strange one, it's $75, I think it's about $75 a tub. In performance, Brian. Signature soaps from Bolton. Performance. This could have gone with value as well. My preferred soap from Brian's is Capra, which is the unscented goat's milk. I do like the Britannia as well. I've tried a lot of Brian's soap and it's a cracking soap base. Pound for pound. It's as good as that, but without the bling. That's how good it is. And I could use Capra every day of the week. It is so... You don't even need, don't even need a moisturiser for the post shave. So that's the performance. So we'll have a quick recap. Scent was a &E. Selection was Wickham. Darren's scenting is absolutely superb on his soaps. Sentiment, OSP, value for money, Martin de Candre, and performance, signature soaps. I could have picked Swedish Rich for performance, but Sarah's soaps aren't the, aren't the easiest to get, get hold of. I uh, could have picked Matty Lindholm soaps, but again, not the easiest to get hold of to the general public. It's a small clique of people who know how to get how to get hold of them. That's why those two didn't appear. Anyhow, that's it for this video. Obviously, I had a shave yesterday. I'm not going to shave again tonight. I've just done my head. Uh, I'm fine. We're all ticking away nicely. I just kind of fallen out of love with YouTube shaving videos. It's been a while since I watched one, let alone recorded one. Uh, I've no doubt that urge will return as the summer progresses. We shall see. Uh, anyhow, to those of you who are s s still subscribed, 
thanks for hanging around it's much appreciated uh, take care of yourselves we'll see you soon thanks for watching bye for now